Hello again, everybody. It's Harry Boxer, the technical trader. It's Wednesday, the 20, excuse me, Thursday, the 24th, and uh, this is the charts of the day. Today, I'm going to review or re-review the um, ultra shorts that we put up yesterday uh, because they made substantial projects, and I wanted you to see how they, they've developed and where they stand. As you can see, the six, seven-day base on the BGZ, which is up first, uh, uh, concluded with yesterday's sharp rally to 21.22, opened near there, and then exploded up to the 20. 175.80 um, area platform for the rest of the session. Let's take a look at it closer. As you can see, got up to about 22.20 or so by uh, late afternoon and then backed off, but it'll support. It's trading a bit higher in the aftermarket. The key to this is that I believe that, that <coughs> the platform uh, or flag above the br base breakout is a, uh, coming off of a heavy volume surge is um, a very bullish pattern and that we could see an extension that tests at least the 23.10, 20 zone, my next target. Beyond that, uh, target is 25 and 27.50. Those, that's what I'm looking at potentially if uh, we get a nice follow through on these. The second one is uh, EDZ. All of these look similar. The da downtrend, uh, at least the last th three, four week downtrend has been broken. The base was built, the breakout. This one actually looked the best this morning because it was forming a rising channel. Uh, that one also backed off and made a higher low, and then, as you can see, it's gapping up to new highs in the aftermarket. Targets there. Uh, I believe it's possible we get up towards the 835 range, and then possibly as high as 9 to declining tops line. Beyond that, the next target beyond that would be up upwards of the high here around the 10, 15, 20 zone. Moving on to the FAZ, FAZ. That nice base, uh, multi-session base was built. The breakout, a nice little flag in here. New highs, and then a pullback, trading in the aftermarket uh, a, a little bit higher. <clears throat> the, the lateral price target is about 22.35. Beyond that, I see a, a move that takes us maybe up to 24-ish. And longer-term target on the FAS, when I say longer-term, I'm talking several days, uh, around 27 range, maybe 28 uh, is potentially doable. The SRS. Looked the best of all of them yesterday. It didn't act as well today, but it did surge through and then flag for the rest of the session and is also trading higher in the aftermarket. Um, targets on this, 1085, 1120. Uh, and then beyond that, I think we can get up towards that 1295 to 13 level, and maybe even as high as 1385, my uh, uh, multi-session target uh, on that one. And lastly for today, the TZAs. Um, <coughs> broke out above initial resistance platform just underneath secondary resistance um, my next target is 13 and a quarter followed by 14 and a half and 1570 um, that's it for this evening um, you have a good evening and we'll talk to you tomorrow hello again everybody it's Harry Box